Today we're going to talk about setting up GPS offsets in a new self-propelled sprayer we're creating in our edge display. The first step I want to do is push the setup or the wrench icon on the home screen. From here I want to push the application icon, select the vehicle tab at the top of the screen, and now I want to push the green plus icon to add a new vehicle. Select the drop down box to specify the vehicle type. In this case it will be a self propelled sprayer and we'll push next. We'll specify a make and model. In this instance my make is demo and my model will be sprayer. And we'll push next. Full swath width for this sprayer is 30 feet so we can push next. I need three boom sections for my sprayer, so I'll put enter three boom sections and push next. Each boom section will be 10 foot in width. That looks good, so we can push next. I'm not running the NORAC UC5 boom height control system, so I'll leave that box unchecked. And we'll push next. The vehicle will be named Demo Sprayer. We'll go ahead and accept that by pushing the green check. Now I select my sprayer from the list and push the wrench icon and now I push GPS offsets. The first measurement I need to take is the antenna location from rear axle. And in this instance it's 165 inches. It's also important to specify whether it's in front of or behind the rear axle. Antenna location from center line since my GPS antenna is directly in the middle of my sprayer, I can leave that at zero inches. And my antenna height from ground, in this instance, is 170 inches. If we push the mount tab at the top, we need to measure from our dispensing location to the rear axle. And it's important to pay attention to the drop-down box there that says in front or behind. If I have a front mount boom, I need to make sure I specify in front here but since I have a rear mount boom I'm going to specify behind and I'm going to put in 60 inches for my sprayer. We'll push the green check there to accept it. GPS offsets are important to put in. If you don't get them in correctly the auto swath will not function correctly. For more information on entering GPS offsets please consult your edge reference manual.